Hi everybody, it's Joe Krug from FinSuite with a new FinSuite Webflow hack. In this hack, we learn how to mirror the user as they are typing in a text input. The user is going to be filling out the form, typing in a text input, and we're going to mirror the exact same thing that they're typing into a text element. This is going to add another layer of customization, personalization, and interaction to your web forms. Let's jump in and see how it works. We're in the live example. We have a Webflow form on the page and we have some text on the page. As I start filling out these form fields, the text elements are going to update in real time. So if my name is Joe and my email is joe at finsuite.com, we can populate that customized message for the user in real time. Let's go into designer and see how this is set up. We're in designer, we have our form, we have our text. Each one of these is going to get its own unique ID. Here in the name field, we have name input and on the email field, we have email input. Then we have our text as name text and our email as email text. So with these four IDs, we're going to be able to tie these fields and text elements together with JavaScript. If you have a much larger form, you can duplicate this process as many times as you want. You can have 20 fields and 20 different elements under here. Just make sure they have unique IDs that we can then tie together in JavaScript. Let's get into the custom code, see how this works. Let's break down this code line by line. Before the closing body tag, we're going to insert our script. This is a simple one, it's very easy to understand. We're going to target our name input and on key up, on typing, when the value changes here, we're going to run a function. And that function is targeting our name text and changing the text to this, which is this value. So let's go over that part one more time. We have this name text, we're updating the text, we are targeting this here, and this is going to refer to our name input, and we're going to get the value of this name input. So as we are keying up, as we're typing, this text is going to continuously change its value based on what is in this name input and the exact same thing happens for the email input. We have the email input on key up, we're running the function, we'll target the email text, and we're going to change the text to this value. This inside this function is going to be the email input, and we update it with the current value. If you have 20 fields or 50 fields, you can duplicate this 50 times, no problem, and as long as you have the unique IDs, this will work. That's how we do this. Enjoy, have fun customizing and personalizing your experience for the user. Thank you so much for checking out this hack. Please clone the project. We have the entire hacks project available for clone. Start learning how these hacks work and use them on your live site. We're always releasing new hacks. So if you want to be updated, subscribe to our YouTube channel. If you want a super simple plain text email when we release a new hack, sign up at finsuite.com slash hacks dash updates. If you want to request a hack, we'll check it out and see if it's possible in Webflow. Go to finsuite.com slash hacks dash request. That's effing sweet.